What is up guys, Fashion Photo is here and today my hair is just fucking not working with me today. I look like a fucking weeb as fuck. So today I'm gonna be doing um, basically some pickups. I just haven't had the time where I never really know when it's the right time to do like a pickups video because I don't want to just become like a channel that does like pick up video after pick up video and they're only picking up like one or two things so I never want to be like hey guys I got a pair of socks to review even though I did do a fucking um basic series on socks Hello, darkness, my but yeah you guys kind of get what I mean so this is going to be my recent pickups some of these videos you are like some of these uh, products you've already seen in videos and I've done like specific videos for them and others they're gonna be future videos but just know this is kind of like a preview for whatever I'm gonna be doing in the future so ah! my pickups are like right there and it's like behind the camera because I have so many things that I have to get out. Okay, so let's do shoe pickups first. So first up is you guys have already seen um, from my like bring Nike back discussion video. I recently purchased the Footscape Magista in a size 8, the OG colorway. I didn't have them in the box because I had them downstairs and I was like wearing them yesterday. So. These are the OG uh, Footscape, I mean, Magistas. I love these to death. I am probably gonna pick up the Wolf Gray version soon as well because there's like a listing on Grailed and I really, really fucking want the Wolf Gray version. I mean, it's a dope shoe. People have commented that these look like the Balenciaga uh, Speedrunners and I thought that too, except um, I feel like Balenciaga took some inspiration from the Footscape Magista, cause like they look pretty damn similar. This came out like a few years back, so I don't know. And I think these are super comfortable as well. My second uh, footwear pickup is going to be the Acronym Presto Lows. They're not Acronym Presto Lows, dude. I wish they came out with Lows. The Acronym Presto Mids with the bamboo colorway. This I do wear pretty often. My only gripe is that the side zipper, one of them keeps on coming down after like maybe an hour of wear and I have to continually like check up on it and like pull the zipper up. I'm not sure it's whether or not I got thick as hell legs Oh! Or whether or not it's gonna be because I'm just wearing them wrong or I'm wearing too thick socks or something like that But so I'm like around an eight to an eight and a half and I believe I picked up an extra small which is an eight to a nine So if you guys have the neon colorway or the olive colorway for a decent deal They don't have to be brand new hit me up hit my Instagram up or hit my grilled up They're both gonna be in the description below and yeah I'm looking to complete the set because I think this looks super cool and it's great quality, you know? By the way, the leather on the back is pretty good. So now that we're done with footwear, let's get on to... I know you see a bunch of jackets over there, but let's get on to pants, which is right behind the camera. The first up are these Nike Tech Fleece pants. So on the right side, it has this super, super long extended zipper. I actually really, really like the design of this. The comfort is, it's all right. Like it's decently comfortable. It's not the most comfortable pants that I've worn, but it has a decent functionality. Like on the right side, it has a super long extended zipper and you can actually fit a lot of shit in here. So I think that's really cool. And it has a hidden back pocket with a zipper as well. And I believe they're both YKK, but I don't think they're like Vizlon or anything like that. So next up is actually gonna be a part of my budget tech wear series that I'm gonna be revealing or doing soon. It's gonna be from Old Navy. This is. I guess they're uh, Old Navy, Old Navy Active. Yeah, it's their Old Navy Active um, Tech Fleece pants. I guess these are like an alternative to the Nike Tech Fleece. This only costed me like less than twenty dollars, and it works just as well as the Nike Tech Fleece. Doesn't have that like super long zipper, but everything just works perfectly fine, and it has their like go dry technology, which is supposed to prevent like sweating and like moisture next up i was actually planning to do a video on these but i'm still like debating whether or not i should it's from a company called uh 
bomb clothing. They have these nice zipper cargo pants, so it has an elastic waist, it has blue, um, blue drawstrings, and it has these cool little detailing. And on the side has the BCC embroidered right there. It has two cargo pockets, one on each side, and has these um, has the Velcro straps on the bottom so you can tighten and loosen depending on your fit. Also comes with metal YKK zippers. So I might do a small little video review on these guys because I do think their brand needs more exposure because I think they're doing real cool stuff as of late. So I'm gonna be leaving the description or I'm gonna be leaving the link to a lot of these products down below if you guys do wanna pick up whatever I have. Next up is a bit of a fuckboy pickup. I just had a moment of weakness and I was like, wow, that shit looks cool, man. <laughs> it is from Granted London. It is their basically uh, budget fear of God uh, pants or their track pants. Except this is more of like a sweatpants. I actually do like the fit of this. Like the taper is super tight and it's baggy up front. Also has this like pleating detail where they like just basically stitched another seam there. Just just for effect. There isn't really any uh, functionality to it. It's actually really comfortable. Um, it's actually one of the more comfortable uh, sweatpants I've ever worn. It's uh, it's made in Turkey. This is actually not screen printed. It's just another panel. So. It's actually pretty decent quality. I might do like an alternative to Fear of God shit cause, cause Jerry Lorenzo be raping, be violating these 13 year olds and their mama's a debit card and their credit card. And next up is going to be a small separate video on the side. This is going to be the Uniqlo uh, dry cropped uh, joggers, yeah. It's a, it's a fucking mouthful. So these are actually one of my favorite pants as of late. They have a semi-elastic waist where they do have the ability to stretch, but they also have a nice button. This button is actually one of the favorite things about this. Same with the belt, because you have your own built-in belt, and you can basically just attach it, tighten it, and then like loosen like that, easy. 1,000 deaths, what you got on me, boy? So for these, I'm gonna be going more into depth on its own product video. I also picked up the light gray version. I might pick up the navy version as well. You guys definitely should pick it up. I believe it's 1990 right now. Um, I'm not sure if the sale is still going on, but if it is, definitely purchase it down below in the description. I love the fit of this. It's like a loose, but it also has this like nice elastic cuff at the bottom. I just, this is my favorite summer pant, so. It's gonna get its own video soon. And I'm not sure if this should be in the pickups video, but I guess it is technically a pickup. I picked up uh, the Surface Pro. Um, I've been using it for the past couple days. I really like it, I recommend it. Um, so far, I haven't really run into any problems. I just really like the screen. Screen looks awesome. Like Taking notes on this is a breeze. I just, I just wish the tablet itself had more battery. Like, so if I take this tablet or the top part off, there's a button to detach. And you just heard that. It sounds like uh, you're breaking a neck of a uh, fuck boy. But if you take the tablet off, there goes Discord, my boys. Uh. You take the tablet off. I believe this only has like four hours of battery. I'm on like 50% brightness. This has four hours of battery. If you attach the base, I think it gains an extra four. But if you attach the base and you do it the opposite way, like so, and you close it, I think this is the mode that I use it as most when it's kind of like a full thick tablet. This gives me like 14, 15 hours of battery. So I think it's just because I think when you have it open like a normal laptop, the GPU is active, it's gonna give more speed, and it's gonna be able to do a lot more graphic intensive shit. Like, uh, like this, I've actually been uh, studying for, for my genetics class. You know, this is, this is a prime example of what you could be using it with. Uh, my family is dead. You can get this wallpaper in the description below. I'm just kidding. I'm not gonna make this shit into a wallpaper. Please don't request it.